indicating red and green. This indicates that the doorbell camera is ready to be connected to Wi-Fi. If your doorbell camera's LED is not flashing red and green, hold down the doorbell button for 60 seconds to put the doorbell camera into wireless access mode. The LED should now be flashing red and green. The next thing you want to do is grab your smartphone to connect your Alarm.com doorbell camera to your permanent Wi-Fi network and enroll it into your Alarm.com account. The first thing you need to do is open up the Alarm.com app and then click on the menu icon on the very top left corner and then click on doorbell camera. Next, you wanna click on the add doorbell camera button in the middle of the screen and then click begin on the top right. Then click next on the top right. Now we wanna go ahead and type in a name for our doorbell camera. I'm gonna call this one the front doorbell. Then click next on the top right. The next thing that you need to do is open up the Wi-Fi settings for your smartphone and connect your smartphone to the temporary Wi-Fi network named SkyBell followed by some numbers. Then return to the Alarm.com app and choose your permanent Wi-Fi network from the list. Then go ahead and type in your Wi-Fi network password and click Done on the top right. The doorbell camera will then connect to your home's Wi-Fi network and be enrolled in the Alarm.com account. Please allow up to five minutes for this process to complete. Our doorbell camera has now been connected to the home's Wi-Fi network. The next thing you want to do is enable push notifications so that you will get a push notification on your smartphone anytime someone rings that doorbell. After you've enabled push notifications, you need to set your recording schedules for that doorbell camera. By default, your doorbell camera is always going to record a video when someone presses the doorbell button to ring your doorbell inside the home. We also recommend enabling motion detection recordings for your doorbell camera. Just toggle the second recording schedule to the on position to enable motion recordings. Then click finish on the top right. Our doorbell camera has now been added to our alarm.com account, so click done on the top right. If you click on the doorbell icon, you can view live view from your doorbell camera. If someone is at your front porch and you want to talk to them, just hold down the green hold to talk button and then release the button when you're done talking. When you're ready to end the call, just press the red end call button. Now we can return to the alarm.com app's home screen by clicking on the menu icon and then clicking the home button. You can see on the home page of our alarm.com app,